my channel and welcome back to another video um so i'm a little late on this because the day i'm filming this it is january 11th we are halfway through january at this point but i haven't had time to film because i've been working like every single day so sorry about that i kind of took last week off because I frankly needed the time to just relax and not think about anything. But this week, we're filming and we're gonna get some content up. So, January, it's a new year, 2022. I can't believe that I'm saying that because it feels like it's still like 2019, but it is in fact 2022. And I did this video last year where I talked about like my resolutions for the year and they're not really resolutions they're more like things that I would like to get done but if they don't then whatever like I don't know the new year is not really an excuse to be like oh I want to do this like you should just make goals anyways at least that's how I see it um so we're just gonna talk about some of my goals for this year and yeah, we'll go from there. So one of the biggest things that I'd like to accomplish this year, which I was not good at last year at all, is more of a personal kind of goal, but I want to be nicer to myself. I want to be more patient with myself. I want to not put myself down as much in 2022 because last year I was not nice to myself at all like I was so mean to myself and it's not healthy frankly um so I want to try to like be more gentle with myself like I want to try to stop um self-negative talk as much as humanly possible because last year I was so fucking bad at it and this year I want to try to you know compliment compliment myself more um be nicer to myself if I can um so that's like top of my list Another thing that I want to accomplish this year is to travel more. If you kept up with this channel like in the last half of the year in 2021, like September through December, you know that I started traveling for shows more, um, which I don't really do. Like the furthest that I had traveled to a show before was to Maryland and that was like five hours away and that was like nothing. It was like a one-time thing and that was it. But in 2021, I went to a bunch of new places that I had never been just for shows. Like, I went to Milwaukee for the first time. I went to Worcester for the first time. I went to Rochester for the first time. I went to a bunch of new places. And I want to do that more in 2022. Of course, keeping money in mind, not just being like, oh, yeah, I'm going to go just to go. Um... But I am already going to Arizona for a show uh, next week. Um, kind of going off of the whole being nicer to myself thing, I am not putting up with people's bullshit this year. Like, I'm simply not doing it. Um, last year, I put up with a lot of people that were simply just terrible to me. I'm not going to go into details, but I had a lot of emotionally draining people in my life last year and I'm simply not doing it this year like if you have a single red flag if you say one wrong thing to me I'm fucking blocking you I don't care um literally in the first two weeks of January of the new year I've already blocked like upwards of 30 people because I simply do not have the time or the energy to deal with it this year like if you are not gonna treat me with respect if you're not gonna fucking give me the love that I deserve if you're gonna manipulate me I'm simply not doing it I'm not putting up with it because I deserve better than that and it's taken me almost 25 years to realize that goal is that I want to discover more music this year and I feel like that's 
a goal that a bunch of people have like every single year but as a music journalist I want to add more artists into my catalog this year because I feel like I just listen to the same fucking bands over and over and as a music journalist who frankly just posted for the first time since September (laughs) I just I need to discover more bands this year so if anyone has any suggestions like whether it's a single song or an album leave it down below because I need to broaden my horizons a little bit the last goal that I can think of right now is that I simply want to stop caring what people think and I guess that kind of ties in with like the being nicer to myself and not taking people's shit kind of thing but okay I have severe anxiety like I every little thing makes me anxious as fuck but this year I need to stop or at least try to stop caring as much about what people think of me because like at the end of the day who fucking cares If someone doesn't like me, that's their problem, not mine. (laughs) Like, if these people would take some time to get to know me, they would know that I'm not that bad. (laughs) Like, I'm not that bad. Um, And I also want to stop caring what people think, like, as far as my appearance goes, I guess. And this kind of ties in with that. I'm so sorry. I'm, like, getting off track. Um, But I want to change up the way I look this year. I want to take care of myself more. Because in 2021, that was another thing. I was so fucking depressed that I did not have the energy to put time or effort into my appearance at all. Like, 99% of the time, I was just not wearing makeup. Unless I was filming... And even sometimes when I was filming, I was still too lazy, too lazy to do anything about my appearance. Like, I would just hop on and be like, here I am. So, I want to put more time and effort into the way I look this year. And that's not even like a, I have to kind of thing. It's more of a, I want to. Because when I look good, I feel better about myself. And when I feel better about myself, I overall feel more happy. Like, in 2022, I really want, I need to be that bitch. Like, I want to break hearts. I want, (laughs) I want all of my exes to see how fucking hot I got this year and simply be angry about it. I am in my revenge arc and I do not care. (laughs) Like, I have been treated like shit for so long And I'm not putting up with it anymore. So y'all deserve to see what you're missing out on and feel fucking angry about it. So anyways, (laughs) um, I already have a hair appointment booked for when I'm in Arizona and I'm super excited about what I'm getting done. I'm not going to spoil it. Um, but this is a hairstyle that I've been wanting for so long, but I've been too fucking scared to get it because I've cared too much about what people think of me. And now I'm just like, I simply do not fucking care anymore. Like if people are, people are going to judge me either way. So I might as well just fucking do it. And if it makes me happy, I'm going to fucking do it. (laughs) Everyone else can go fuck themselves. So that's going to be the first step into taking care of myself, I guess. Um, I want to start dressing more, put together more. I don't want to just stay in my pajamas all fucking day. I want to start going out more, which like now with COVID getting bad again, I were not in a rush to do that. Um, But basically, I just want to take care of myself more. I want to put some effort into my appearance more and yeah I think that's all my goals that I have for this year uh let me know down below what some of your goals or resolutions or whatever are um and yeah it feels good to be back (laughs) uh hopefully I can get this video edited and hopefully it's hopefully it's decent 
um next video is gonna be very exciting next video is going to be my 8123 fest vlog I don't know how much realistically I'm going to film from 8123 fest because frankly I have an iPhone 7 <laughs> so the battery on it is complete shit um, filming, you know, just regular concerts, like, the Umbra Tour con- like, <laughs> the Umbra Tour shows was hard enough, and those are just, like, three-hour shows compared to a festival that's gonna be nine hours long and multiple days long. Um, so we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I have portable chargers, but they're really old, so they don't work that well, but we'll see. I'll get- some kind of footage for you guys it might just not be a lot so that's just like a little bit of a heads up but anyways thank you guys so much for watching i love you all so much and yeah i'll see you in the 8123 fast vlog bye